Investigators are probing possible issues with the way ships are anchoring or drifting off the coast in long lines caused by skyrocketing consumer demand and disrupted supply chains during the pandemic. Officials believe a ship anchored off Huntington Beach hit an undersea pipe, possibly months before the oil began spilling in the ocean. It's unclear how a ship came to lower its anchor on a pipeline when the placement of vessels is supposed to be carefully orchestrated to avoid such mishaps. But the offshore traffic jams have forced ships to wait well beyond their usual zones, dropping enormous anchors near oil platforms and an undersea infrastructure of oil lines. The Coast Guard and the National Transportation Safety Board are focusing on a period early this year when heavy winds may have shifted large vessels over the pipeline. They are examining which vessels were in the vicinity on January 24 and 25 and gathering data on every vessel traveling near the pipeline since last October. In the coming weeks, investigators expect to board several foreign vessels to see whether they were anchored near the pipeline in the last year. Coast Guard investigators have examined several ships that were in the area in the days before the leak and concluded that none of them are likely responsible for the damage to the pipeline, which was last inspected in October 2020. However, U.S. Coast Guard Captain Jason Neubauer said no vessels have been completely ruled out. The investigators are focusing primarily on ship traffic at the port of Long Beach but are also looking at Los Angeles, 